Hey there, happy Sunday. Oh, what a glorious, glorious day it is. It is a Come on really quick. This is Actors Daily Bread and welcome. I hope you had a wonderful day so far. I am Christine Horn. I am a professional actress of over 20 years and a life and career coach for actors. And I just wanted to uh, share today, um, I'm here waiting for the library to open before I go back home. And, you know, I did, in my morning reading today, I'm, I was, I'm reading from a book called Return to Love, a very popular book, I'm sure you've heard of it, by Marianne Williamson on her study of A Course in Miracles. If you haven't heard of it, it's worth checking out. It's very, uh, it's a book with a lot of, a lot of introspection. But I just wanted to share just one thing that I was really that I really was marinating on today. That living from your vision is more powerful than living from your circumstance. I'll say it again. Living from your vision is more powerful than living from your circumstance. What does that mean? We'll fly away here. You know, we can look at where we are in our lives, in our careers. Yes, we have goals or things we want to do, things we are trying to achieve every single day. I know for me, every single day, you know, I have a I have a long laundry list of goals and things that I want to do. And, and if you're watching, give me a thumbs up, give me some hearts, and welcome to the replay watchers if you're watching this on the replay. But there's really so much more power in living from your vision, from the place that you want to be. So it doesn't, it doesn't take away the beauty of the present. You can still be thankful for today. But I think too many times we may be looking only at what is. And so my word for you today is just is to not be fooled by the right now. Right now, there may not be the amount of money you want in your bank account. Right now, you may not have the, the career or the credits that you want, that you desire. Right now, you may be going through a tough time emotionally, but I don't want you to be fooled by right now. I want you to hold true to what it is that you want from your life, what you want to see your life be like. You know, I'm always talking to my clients when I'm doing like life coaching, like, what is your ideal day? What does your ideal life look like? And when I was meditating this morning, I really, I had some great stuff come to me about traveling and some trips that I wanted to take. And I had to get, I started getting really clear about where I wanted to go and what I wanted to wear and what I wanted to experience. So even though right now I can't plan that trip right now, I got clear about what it looked like for me. Think of your life, think of your career, think of everything you're going through as a house, a house that you want to build. And so you can't call the construction guys over to start building your house if you don't even know what the house is supposed to look like. They can't create a blueprint. They can't create any anything. You have to know where you want the bedrooms. You got to tell them where you want the bathroom. Do you want a garden tub or do you want just a shower? You have to be very clear on what it is you want it to look like so that it can be built the way you want it to be built. So be very clear. Set your intentions on what you want and let that be your vision that is your vision it doesn't take away the beauty of today it doesn't mean you're ungrateful for everything you've been through and are going through presently but living from your vision instead of your circumstance will change your life and only you know what that vision is so that's all I got today it's a beautiful day I just say thank you I thank God for you I think I'm just thankful to be this on this side of the earth <laughs> have an amazing day i'm gonna go in this library and get my my books and uh i'll see you guys tomorrow bye